Jim, we've got some breaking news here out of Cape Canaveral. There has been a SpaceX rocket failure on the launch pad. A plume of smoke could be seen from the distance. Let's take a look here, uh, and I think you can see it now in these pictures. NBC's Jay Barbary reports there have been no injuries, um, but we will have more information on this story as it becomes available. The rocket was scheduled to be launched this weekend. Again, no injuries, but not sure about the fate of the rocket wow. uh, right. for SpaceX. Um, by the way, we didn't talk about Tesla or Solar City. You know, there's some numbers. Uh, and the Wall that. Street Journal reporting today. Now, they came out with the proxy yesterday. The Wall Street Journal reporting today about their need to continue to raise cash through whatever means they can at both Tesla and particularly Solar City. I use Axiom's numbers. That's a firm that does a lot of really good work on actual installs. Uh, California applications for rooftop solar down 23.8% month to month, now down 42% year over year. Well, that's bedrock for Solar City. So, I mean, if you actually, people tend to think, well, you know what, it's a must copy, it's doing fine. Well, the fact is, is that solar, and first solar, by the way, really being hurt by the price competition from overseas, you, you, you don't want to touch these. You, you, on an earnings basis, you might want to touch it on a, Elon yeah. Musk is a brilliant man. He's a brilliant thesis, man, but, he's a great marketer, and he's found yeah. an ability to raise capital whenever he needed it. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the eye right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.